Hey everyone, good day, good day. I hope you guys are doing fabulous because I just can't wait to show you my happy mail haul. Um, one thing I got was this beautiful mug and I don't think you guys can see, but see it from the side. It's this beautiful pink with the plum dots all over it. And this was a Valentine's Day surprise gift. It's beautiful. It's heavy. And <clears throat> yeah, I'm still coughing. I'm still sick. And what's in it is grape and I think grape and hibiscus or Conquered Grape and something. This is vinegar. This is Bragg Pro and Prebiotic Vinegar. It is so good. It tastes like you're drinking watered down grape juice with a little hint of vinegar. And it, it's really good. It's probably an acquired taste. It's very healthy for you. If you get a chance, Google Bragg Probiotic, Pro and Prebiotic Vinegar. The Concord Grape is my favorite. There's so many flavors, but that is my favorite. Um, so I'm sipping on that. And, mm, because I definitely got to have something to drink. Because I am still coughing like a crazy person. Oh, wait a minute. Let me show you the one thing. Hold on. Let me go get it. Let me go get it. Let's see if it. <coughs> guys i am better but my voice goes in and out which is nothing new for me um i'm still hacking up stuff so <laughs> in the middle of the night if i have to hack up something i use this little cup you just open the lid and then you just cough into it and then close it back up and set it aside and then dump it you know that type of thing so anyway probably a little bit too much information <laughs> but this came with this mug this was a set and I didn't like the pen that came with it but it says self love club and it has these little notes on it and I just thought that that was cute um and I just put my the pen of my choice on it um I usually have purple ink in this one I don't know why I put black in it this time but don't matter right um so yeah like I said my husband and I we don't really celebrate Valentine's Day <laughs> when we were young it was just something you did you followed tradition um, but we just try to make every day like Valentine's Day you know and we try to live Christmas every day you know that's but it's just nice to have those little surprises all right so hopefully I'll be able to get through this video without too much coughing because we got a lot to get into. All right, I picked this up. This is Cal of a Plan <coughs> Favorite Florals. And this whole entire book is paper stickers. So I am going to turn it to the side so that you guys can see. So I can, you know, flip through it without... Um, you not being able to see it. Okay, so here's the first set of florals that we have. And like I said, this is all paper. Mm. I'm going to sit that over there. This is all paper. None of this is um, clear. I, I love clear, guys, but I prefer paper. Paper is so much easier to deal with. I love that. Look at that color combination. And I love the detail in the flowers. So I definitely love this set. This this is my definitely a winner for me. And I love that there, <clears throat> there is side ones. So this is beautiful. I love this. This was another winner for me. 
Now guys, she still has this book and she does have a clearance sale going on. So hop on over to Kelly Plan. See if there's anything in her clearance sale section that you might like. Um, these are okay. These are okay. I will definitely use these. And these are nice. And you get two of each. And like I said, they're all on paper. This is pretty. I love this. It's a lot of the same style of florals. Um, this is not Live Love Posh. <laughs> this, this is Kelva Plan style florals, but they are still very, very pretty. These I'm just definitely not liking at all. <laughs> but of course I'm going to use them. Um, I definitely like this because I can see the detail in it. Speaking of Kelva Plan and detailed florals, um, she has spring florals, I think it is. I, I can't remember the name of it, but I think it's spring florals that's coming out this Friday. And I looked at her flip through guys and every single floral that was in there, I was impressed with it. It all reminded me of Live Love Posh's, um, florals. It, it, it was detailed. It was great shading. And I noticed that right away. Look at that. I love I love that. That is very pretty. And I love the fact that this is all on paper. And now here we have your, your pumpkins and florals. Um, this is okay. But again, it's that same swirly, you know, same type of flower. You know, but it's still pretty. It, it is repetition. It is the same watercolor swirly like flower, but there are slight differences and it is still so pretty. Voila. There you have it. A different flower, not the swirly watercolor. You've got the sunflowers. And that was the icing on the cake when I saw this book. I had seen it <clears throat> when it first came out, guys, but I, I don't know why I didn't get it. But I love that. Absolutely love that. So now we go back to the same old swirly watercolor florals. But it's still pretty. And I still look forward to getting it. So I think hell of a plan. I think Heather is like, I need to kind of change up my style a little bit. The, you know, her artist... Because I noticed in these this floral box, I mean, not box, but the um, uh, spring florals that's coming out, it's, it, it's not the same, you know, watercolor, swirly um, um, uh, you know, artwork. It, it, there's a lot of artwork in that book that's coming out that reminds me a lot of Live Love Posh. So I was like, oh yeah, I'm definitely going to get that. This is nice. So, and this is nice. See how this is a little bit different? Different flowers, like different artwork. And then we go back to the swirly watercolor stuff. I'm not going to lie. I, I, I hate that. I'm so glad that she's like looking around and changing up her style. Um, same swirly thing, but I again I can't help but repeat myself, guys. It's still so freaking fabulous. I mean, it's this is just beautiful. This is just a beautiful book, and I love the majority of the florals in here. But my favorite are the sunflowers. Um, wrong, wrong has the best sunflowers. Her and in Kelva Plan, but I'm talking about just not Kelva Plan, um, Black Mountain Plans. But as far as sticker books are concerned, in the category of sticker books, um, Wrong Wrong has the prettiest sunflowers I have ever seen in a sticker book because it was purples and plums and mixed in with the, the yellows. And I showed you guys that it's in her Blooms 
or little blooms or blooms and it's on um amazon but she also has the pet tape but the pet tape you get a whole lot more of those beautiful plums and blues for the sunflowers um and it's on pet tape so you get a lot of it so i just peeled it off the pet peeled it off the roll and put it on a sheet and put it in my sticker book um storage so it'll be on a show it's on a sheet like this you know but it she's the only one the only one but again guys this is still a very beautiful book and I'm glad I got it I really am but I do look forward to you know what she has coming out see the detailing on the cover that's what I like you've got that lined look now if that was on you see how you have this right if that <laughs> was on here that would be great if this was lined and had more detail then it would be so much 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 better so that's what I'm talking about but yeah you know like this this I absolutely cannot stand at all if it was lined and if it looked more like that I would probably I would like it but look at that it's a thick book and I think it was only $28. But before we go, <clears throat> voila. This is Live Love Posh. I did not get the complete um, seasonal box. And they actually have another box out now, which is Seasonal Elements, which is beautiful. Um, I have no intentions of getting that. But they also had this. And I'm sure you guys already know. But out of all of the seasons... You would think, okay, I'm going to buy the fall. Nope, didn't have sunflowers. <laughs> and winter was beautiful. And fall was beautiful too. Summer was fabulous. But spring had the most stickers that I liked. You know, so that's how I kind of determine whether or not I'm going to buy a sticker book. I count how many pages are absolute wins for me. And how many are just, eh, okay. And how many, you know, do I just not like at all? And the spring had the most flowers on it that I absolutely love. And you all know when it comes to sticker books, Live Love Posh is number one. Has always been, I love Live Love Posh. Look at that. Look at that beautiful detail beautiful shading now this is however on really thick clear matte but oh well right so you get two of those this I already used they were the least that I liked they were not ugly but I just didn't like them so look at that that is look at that color combination that is so beautiful I love that and you get two of those and then you get this which I absolutely adore love it love 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 all right these eh, I don't I'm not really liking these these look like kind of a plan florals um, swirly watercolor so I don't I'm really not liking these but they're still beautiful and I'm still gonna use them so you get two of those and oh my gosh, is that not stunning? That is absolutely beautiful. Look at that. I love that. The only thing I don't like is the yellow that's inside, but that's what the flower looks like though. But it, it's still, it's just, I love the shading and I love, I just love it. All right, so let's move on. So you get two of those and then you get this. And you get the washi strip. Let me see if you guys can see. You get that washi strip like on there. So you got two of those. <clears throat> and look at this. Oh, looky, looky. Is that not beautiful? Those are little butterflies. That is so cute. Oh, my Lord. <laughs> I love it. Absolutely love it. Yeah, I love that. So that was another win. And then I like this. 
can you see out oh, look at those pretty blues and the plums and though it is like watercolor it's still different it's not swirly swirly you know it's it's beautiful I love it so I was like yes that was another win and then you get another set of that but a different so look at that isn't that not gorgeous all right and then you get these which are really pretty but I'm not I didn't buy the book for this I will put it to you that way so again we have the swirly swirly watercolors but look at that adding that to it just really enhanced the whole thing so I like it and that is the last set everything else is your boxes which you guys are familiar with and that look at that that is just so gorgeous on every level that is just beautiful so I save these cards use them as tip-ins journal cards whatever but I keep those so that is that for um, where we at we're at 15 minutes 16 minutes great so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to I went ahead and I got happy mail but I put it away <laughs> I'm sorry hold on guys hold on here we go mm. oh that vinegar is good ice cold ah all right, what I got and didn't show you guys was I've got more, I got more of those little, little ephemeras from Personalize My Planner. Remember I showed you the card that she has where every order you get a set of freebies and um, so I used them already, but this set came today and this is like and I don't know what I think it's a bottle of perfume could be and I love that journal look at that book so I'm definitely gonna add that somewhere in here I don't know that's gorgeous let's see where if I can add it I put tape on here so I probably shouldn't have done that Ah, oh well, we put it right there. That's cool. And then you got these beautiful leaves. Let me see if I can stick that in there. Oh yeah, yeah. And then you got that. Now that covers up the kitty. Can't have that. And look at that. Is that not cute? Mm -mm -mm. So we'll put that in there. But it covers up the bottle. If I put it in. Ah covers up the bottle and oh, we don't want that all right so we'll just leave it there how's that so I love that so check out <clears throat> personalize my planner and this came today too and I don't know if you guys can tell but what it is is a sticker sheet of little icons and they're I think these they're on white paper but can you see they're like really shiny and they're really tiny and here's a little girl praying um, or maybe a woman adult and you got a Bible book and all of these different things and I just thought they were just so so cute they are very dainty and I think this is I think I ordered the rose gold but it could be gold I'm not sure and so I did want to share that with you, but she has an extension pack. So if you go over to, um, let me fix this a little bit. If you go over to her Etsy shop, you'll see that she's got a little bit more than I thought she had. And I added this. Do you guys remember, was it last year when I went to AliExpress and found all these washy stickers that are cherry blossoms um and i thought that would be a perfect perfect combination um what i want to show you guys really quick um oh these were the flowers that i didn't like <laughs> that was in live love posh that's what those are the ones i had already used 
Yeah, because I just thought that even though I didn't like them, they went well. I thought they went well. And of course, you know, that's the lined florals from Live Love Posh. My, I think that is one of my favorite, probably my, the absolute favorite, that and the favorites, Live Love Posh favorites, which is sold out. But that was one book where the majority of the florals was, it was crazy how much I could use it. Okay, here we go. This right here, and I don't know how much of it you can see, but it says prayers. It says prayers right across here. This is part of the extension pack that I was telling you about. And... You get 20 sheets, and that's, oh, that's beautiful. That will be a great, like, currently page where you can decorate with boxes and florals. And then you have this here that says the Lord's Prayer, Prayer Guide. Honey, trust me, I don't need a prayer guide. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I don't need any help in that department. But um, I really wanted to support her um shop and I really like what she had in here and I mean this is just great to have I mean it's just nice and you can put prayer requests in here all these different types of boxes you've got your header all of that is right in your Kelava plan and your live love posh I mean we've all got those boxes that we can use so you know this is just great I love prayer requests it doesn't have to be a prayer request from someone else you know, it could be your own prayer request. And then we have prayer, focus, praise, repent, ask, and at the bottom, yes. So I just thought that was cute. And you get quite a bit of pages of that. And then these are the other the other part that you guys have already seen. Um, that was it. I think there was something else that came in that you know, I can't remember, guys. Let's see. Yes, this came with it. Okay. This pretty page. I love that. So pretty. And all of this, you can't really tell unless you look up close, but it is Strength and Courage, Week 10, read on March 4th through the 10th, read Psalms 16, verse 8. That is your verse for week 10 of the Bible study program that she put together and you have through March 4th through the 10th to read that scripture ponder on it let it carry you through that whole week so that was really nice that was really beautiful now here you can see it a lot more clearly um let me see okay there you go. So here is Wisdom and Guidance, week 23, which would be the week of June the 3rd through the 9th. You would read Matthew chapter 6, verses 20 through 21. And that's what you would focus on that entire week. So this is actually really, really cute, really, really dainty. Um, I love how she did that. Oh, that's just cute. All right. Let me keep going. And you've got these pretty pictures that I really, really love. These pretty pictures. And I think there was something else. Yeah, you got these. These came along with it. Extra sheets. And I can't think of any. I think that was it that came with it. Um, these came from Planners Anonymous. You guys are already familiar with that. <coughs> I just decorated that. Um, I don't think um, this was the biblical affirmations that I did a little bit more work on because I had gotten another sheet. So I kind of like this one better. Oh, wow, that didn't stick. I tested out my glue gun that my husband got me for Christmas and I, <laughs> and I made these out of the scrapbook paper. And right here, as you can see, that opens, and I put a sticker on this, and that opens. But this one, I must didn't put put it on there soon enough, and the glue dried. No problem, I can fix that. 
but me and glue guns are really not going to be working together we're not going to be getting along too well um you really have to make sure that you put your paper down or your cloth down while the gun is still hot and then i did these and i think i these you already see but this page here i need to i need to work on that i need to fix that so this is a fun little project i don't think there's anything else in here that you guys um i added that again those beautiful beautiful cherry blossoms and I was like I've got to use these things because I had went through my stash and I was like okay Pam you've got a lot of florals that you need to use that you have not used and here's the perfect opportunity for you to use them so I may just for the heck of it do a what's in my um, stationary luggage Oh, I know. Sorry. You also get this Bible reading tracker. I love that font. You see that font? I love that. Um, of course, I don't need this at all. And you guys might not need it either. We've read all of the books. I read all of the books in the Bible twice. But they are ref they're fresh and brand new every time. And I need to do it again. I really do. I need to do it again. But I love the artwork on here. And this is just beautiful. So somebody might want this. Somebody might need this. But I'm keeping it. I'm not getting rid of it. Um, what else? What else? Um, what I did want to show you guys. I was so impressed. I think I showed you guys this stuff already. I'm almost positive I did. But it was... I had something that I thought was new that I had that I had done. And I, of course, I can't remember. Let me see. Oh, yeah. The little Dutch doors that I made in the middle. I like that. And I probably showed you guys that. But I know for a fact I did not show you um, this. I know I didn't because I just recently did that. And I thought that it was a perfect combination for those stickers with the birds that I got. And I just thought that that looked really, really nice. I love that combination. And this one, I just went all out, as you can see. And then I just put all those cherry blossoms on there. I couldn't help it. I just had fun. I just had fun. But really, that's all for for that. I, I do have a couple other videos that I need to make, but because I need to get on the ball. But I'm hanging in there, guys. And I want to thank y'all so much for allowing me to share with you some of the things that I've done and I hope that you all have a blessed day and I do want to give shout out to Travel Lady and Cherie and May and Kalani and James thank you all and Lee thank you all so much for being so faithful and I appreciate y'all so much and I hope that you guys are doing well I hope that you guys are in, enjoying yourselves I hope the weather is okay where you're living at and I hope that um you are staying you know you're still you're just hanging in there and you know just hanging in there <laughs> you know you just you you keeping your head above water you guys are doing good you know i mean so i pray for y'all i pray for your spouses i pray for your children your siblings your pets that everybody and everything that's in your circle and that is all about you is doing well so i will see y'all in the next video and I appreciate y'all. And that's it for now. Bye.